Welcome everyone to Fallout 1 in 2023. Uh, in this episode, we're going to visit the Boneyard, the, specifically the LA Boneyard, or what's left of LA. And in the last episode, we actually visited the Brotherhood of Steel. And we got some nice power armor, and we got um, some new weapons and stuff like that, a good time. But now, it's time to visit the Boneyard. I don't quite remember this place very well. Um, a lot to do here, but if I may be honest, I don't. I don't really remember. I know there's like goo, like green, uh, like vats goo, and there's like um, a bunch of death claws, but that's about it. So uh, let's see what happens. Um, looks similar to the hub a little bit. Uh, same structures, but that's just the game itself. Uh, but this place is the L.A. or what is? Once was LA. There's a guy in this tent somewhere, and uh, he actually. Yeah, here he is. Okay, so uh, we talked to him, and we can actually raise our luck just by talking to the guy. So uh, here he says, uh, "Hello, stranger. May I be of service?" Um, I'm getting to know the people of Antium. I'm called Chuck. Welcome to Antium. I'm afraid that most of the people here aren't too forthcoming with strangers, though. Um, what's your job, Chuck? I'm a farmer. I I also like to do a bit of work on the on buildings, restoring them and keeping them intact. I give advice. Uh, what kind of advice? Chuck pulls out a set of Eric cards. Let me con let me consult the cards. He shuffles the cards. Chuck pulls out a card and picks up a man with a vibrant knife and a flag. Prince of Swords in the Northwest, you must force, you must face a powerful foe from the Northwest. Uh, oh, thanks for the advice. Good journeys, Wanderer. Hello, what can I do for you? Uh, I'm looking for a little advice. Was it the tarot cards? Hmm. Thanks for the advice. Judy's wonder. Alright, now we're looking for a person called Miles. And I think he's in here. He's right here. I see him. Thin man with a white smack. Mock. I don't even know what that means. Um. I don't believe we met. I'm Miles. What can I do for you? Uh, that smock makes you look like a scientist. What are you studying? I'm a chemist mostly. I might make powder and powder that we can reuse the brass casing from your bullets. But I double, I dabble with some other chemicals. Where do you get the sulfur and potassium nitrate and other chemicals? It's unusual to find someone who can appreciate chemistry. But to answer your question, some of the materials we get from the hub merchants, other manufacturers, or just in the area. For instance, dung heaps from the Brahmin are a good source, as well as some of the stains of the fungus that I can cultivate. Uh, so you make bullets for Edentium? Yes, although Smitty is one of the who, who can actually uh, cast the bullets, I just refill the, the breast casings. But the hub merchants make a profit off you in the town. Yes, well, we have to make a living. Since the hydroponic farms aren't functioning, we have to buy food from the merchants, and bulls are the only thing we have to sell. I could try to get the parts to fix your hydroponic farms. Really? That would be wonderful. We're just missing a few parts, but I'm sure that you can get, scrounge up the right pieces. We could be self-sufficient. Semiel uh, might be able to give you some help. Who is Samuel? Samuel? Hey, I don't believe we met. You are. I'm Melon. Oh, there he is. Okay, the pleasure's mine. I'm Samuel. Uh, Miles said I should talk to you about fixing um, parts for your hydroponic farms. Uh, do you know anything about that? Uh, yes, a matter of fact, I do. Last week, I sent a guy up north to look for the parts for Miles. But we haven't heard anything from him since. 
last transmission I got from him was this that he found uh, the parts and he was on his way back I haven't had any time to check it on it personally yet and uh, I don't want to lose another person to whatever may have caused his disappearance uh, Uh, great, thank you. Uh, I'll search that area for parts and I'll let you know if I can find your missing friend. Would you? That'd be great. Like I said, uh, things have been busy around here and I can't afford to lose any more people. Take me there. I'm a scavenger. Uh, my job is to search out LA Boneyard for useful items and inf information. Dangerous work. How do you avoid death claws? We only work at night and we're good at we're good at what we do, but I'll admit not everyone always comes back. Last week I sent a guy north to look for some parts for miles. And we haven't heard from him since. The last transmission I got from him was that he found the parts. He was on my his way back. North. Okay. So it's toward it's towards the death claws. Uh why is it dangerous? Well, you got the death claws out there, and then you got the hide regulators back here in Adentium. Both ain't the most forgiving types. Have you scouted out any other areas? Uh, I've done a little scouting, but what, what, who do you want to know about? We got the blades. The blades are pretty sorry, uh, a pretty sorry sight for a group of people. Uh, they get by, they get by though, and some of them end up here in Adentium if they agree. To what uh, the regulators offer them to do. The death claws. Well, if you haven't seen them before, they're mean as hell, and nothing like I, uh, and like nothing more than to rip a poor scab's heart out. I've heard that there's a nest of them somewhere in the east of the blades, but I haven't seen it myself. The gunrunners. The gunrunners moved into a big factory up to the northeast not too long ago. I can't tell you how much be, uh, because they have a moat filled with radioactive sludge and you gotta get through it. The death cause to get there. The followers of the apocalypse. The followers preach uh, peace and tolerance. Nice idea, but impractical. They live in a big library to the northwest of here. Uh, the, the children of the cathedral. The children of the cathedral are based out on a big church that a ways to the south of here. Uh, there, they, there are some strange things going on there. I've seen creatures that can't be human coming in and out of there. And the stories are right. The church is built of over an old vault that Tim's predecessors lived in. Be around if you see me. Okay. Now we gotta find Zimmerman here. Hey Zimmerman, uh, good day, what can I do for you? Um, may I ask you your name? Well, why, everyone just called me Spinny, uh, Smitty, uh, probably because I'm a local blacksmith. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask away. Uh, where'd you get all your shop equipment? Why, any competent blacksmith can make his own anvil, of course. I really just saw, sort of, uh, learned the craft by, by practice. I made the worst, made the most of my own tools. Uh, what all do you make here? Mostly I make repa make and repair tools and implements here. I also fix things for the hub merchants. With the help of Miles, the chemist, I read little bullets from time to time. Uh, what do you, what, do, what all do you make here? Mostly, I, oh, alright, I asked that question, didn't I? Uh, can you make guns and bullets? Well, building guns and making shells takes machining, and I just don't have the tools for that. But with the help of Miles and the chemist, I can reload and brass since he, so I can cast bullets. Nothing else. Zimmerman, where's Zimmerman? Nope, not in there. Oh, he's gotta be in here. Yeah, okay. Middle-aged man in the civilian clothing. What do you want? Uh, who are you? I'm John Zimmerman, mayor of Edentium. What, what is, what's it to you? <laughs> uh, 
Uh, your guards said you had a job for me. I might. Have you dealt with the vicious muttering band of the thieves before? Um. What is it out here? Is there any place in the wasteland that doesn't have a gang problem? Uh, you dealt with gangers before? Um. Yeah, yeah, you could say that. Good. Then you know about how roots and bloodthirsty they are. Uh, the blades are the worst of them. Uh, I'm afraid we're we're a, we're a humble, uh, God-fearing town that is only trying to survive. And these these monsters prey on us. He whispers under his breath, and our children. Uh. Yeah, yeah, that's great. Uh, what's the job entail, and what's it worth to you? I'll give you two thousand caps if you kill their leader. I want that. I want that bitch's head. Um. You seem to have something personal against her. She had my son kidnapped, tortured, and killed. They left him impaled on a post right outside the gates. Those sick bastards. I'll take the job. Thank the gods. Uh, finally, my my son shall be avenged. The blades camp is uh to the north of here. Come back when you've got done the job. Now it's gotta find um the uh the death call area to get the regulator. Oh, so here's the blades. The signs of gang activity are evident in the partially rebuilt nightclub and tiny outpost here. You see a sign. This is the blades hideout. Not looking around. Um, who that? Remember the blades. I'm kind of. I'm gonna keep my distance. Save as well. Uh, L.A. Boneyard. Over here. I'm just gonna go do some exploring, and I want to see what I can find. Looks familiar. I believe the, the yep, death claws. Shit. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. I got power armor, so I should be fine. Uh, dog meat, however, might die. So that's why I saved. Ninety-five percent. Thirty-seven hit points. I'll take it. Um. I wish I can see how much health they have. Let's just say. Uh, a poster. A movie poster from a horror movie in the pre-war days. Ripper. So it appears that there is only one more death call, which I am cool with. Well, uh, it seems that Ian want to take the initiative. Um, uh, come on, Ian. Oh, oh. Where is that death call going? Dog meat? I swear if you die. Um. Goodness. Oh, goodness. Okay. Um. Oh, I can go to this corner. Okay, I see. Hey, there we go. Ooh. Here's the dead guy we're looking for, and this is the junk that we need. Oh, he didn't make it. Super machine. Um, we'll get dog meat real quick. One dog meat. Uh, come on, buddy. That. Another ordinary. Um. Let's loot these uh these containers. Hopefully there's stuff in them. Booze and shotgun shells. Nothing. Anything else? Something? 
Yeah, that's it. Oh, the gunners are this way. You got nuts. All right, dog meat. Um, I'm gonna save. I have a strange feeling. I'm gonna walk into that goo. Die. Oh, there it is. Um, glowing goo surrounding it. Just wonderful. Do that. Go over there. The gun runners. That. Dunk. Hmm. Guess I gotta cross over here. Alright. What if I can tell my teammates to stay put? Oh no. Psycho, please do not get yourself killed. And he's gone. Uh, what's your business here? Um, I just, uh, I want to speak to your, I need to speak to your boss. It's very important. Okay, Gabriel, we'll talk to you. Go on. <laughs> Hope the AI figures it out. We can only hope. We can only hope. Looks like the play. Oh, my gun's up. Oh, Tycho, what are you doing, man? What, what are you doing? What's going on here? Gun runners. All right, let's see what's going on here. Um, gun runner. Hi, I'm Zach. What do you uh, you want to buy some weapons? Let me see what you have to trade. Um, okay. Oh, crap. Power fist. Paddle prod. Mini gun. Flamethrower. To come back here later. Cool gun runner. Where's this Michael person? This person. Not often that we get visitors. How can I help you? Uh, what is it you do here? We manufacture weapons and ammunition. We've we've been out for the last thirty years. And the last 10 have been hell. Why is that? Uh, we stripped the area surrounding our factory of all the scrap metals that we can... That were left over after the war. Uh, now we have to really... Now we have to rely on Adentium to supply us with the raw materials. What's so bad about Adentium supplying you with the raw materials? At first it was fine. They supplied us with the enough raw materials that we manufactured and sold, sold the weapons. Then three years ago, Zimmerman hired... Some mer mercenaries to help protect the Dantium from the Death Claw and uh, the odd random attack by raiders. Those regulators are cold hearted bastards and uh, are squeezing us for all we have. We make the guns and they get rich off of it. Uh, that's rough. Uh, what would you give me to take care of the Death Claw? If you could get rid of the death claws once and for all, you name your price. I want am uh, weapons and ammunition, and lots of it. If you clean out that area, we'll be leaving. And uh, but we will leave behind more weapons and ammunition that you could possibly use. Okay, you got yourself a deal. Did it. Uh, it's not. Uh. Why don't you, why don't you get many visitors? This is very uh. Very, this place isn't very accessible with the nest of those damn death claws right outside our factory. You guys seem really fair well armed. Why don't you exterminate them? 
We've gone over there and taken them out a few, but they they always seem to come back. Uh, besides, we're machinists, not fighters. Uh, what what would you give me if I uh, I went in there and took care of them for you? If you can get rid of those death claws, well, yeah, okay, we did that. Okay. Did I need to go back there? Where the basement at? Oh. Basement. Oh, oh, right here. There's a basement. Oh. Okay. On. On. I wish I knew what health it was at, but I don't know. Not. No. Come on. Come on. Damn. Yeah, we lost Taiko in battle. I think we're too close to itself. Taiko will be remembered. But to be honest, he was kind of an asshole. We must finish this battle. go we may have lost Tycho but he will be remembered the remains of Tycho taking his stuff you did well Tycho you did well but you had all the stuff in your inventory and you never used it <coughs> Taking it. Did uh, good. Where is it? I'll be taking that as well. And there's nothing on it. That's quite a, that's fun. Okay, uh, what's this? Well, I'm gonna get this lock fix. Ian Ian again. Oh, no. Well, egg. Break all these eggs. Hope that was Ian saying that, and not the eggs. Oh, it's, a, it's all of them. It's all of them. Cool. We're out of here. Rest in peace, Tycho. Died in battle. One dog meat. Actually, you're staying here. Uh, but like over here. Um, stay here. Death Claw, Boneyard. Now let's go turn in this quest. What? You killed them all? Thank the gods. Now we can move on to the new place where we can get out. 
out on our own um, materials and not have to rely on those snakes in the Adentium. You name it and you got it, my friend. I want weapons and ammunition. Lots of it. You got it. Just take whatever you want. We're pulling out of here in a day or two. Uh, but we will leave enough weapons and ammo for you so you can carry it right now. Just come back here whenever you need them. Uh, fair enough. It's been a pleasure doing business with you. How it goes it? Uh, been okay. Hey, what? Yeah. Waiting for an hour and 11 minutes already. Where's dog meat? Where'd dog meat go? Oh, oh, oh goodness. Okay, okay. All good. All good. Everything's fine. Let's head back to uh, with the regulator and fix their uh, their their farms. They found the parts yet? Yes, here they are. Uh, Miles looks over the parts. Those are the items. It looks like Smitty uh, is going to have to do a little work on them. Can you take them over to him? Uh, sure. I'll be back. I'll be back after I fix them. I know, Semio. Oh, Smitty's in here. Good day. Uh, good day. What can I do for you? I need you to fix these parts for me so that I can fix your hydroponic farms. Yes, I can fix this. Give me some time. Here you are. Spin your hands to the fixed parts. Miles takes the fixed parts from you. Looks like Smitty did a great job on these. Thanks for the help, and here's some stuff for your trouble. I was handing some caps and some syntax. That's fantastic. Uh, if, if you ever get back this way, you might want to look uh, me and Smitty up. I might be able to help you out with some adjustments to equipment. Uh, Smitty can work on wonder can work wonders with certain weapons, and I can help out uh, with certain sorts of armor. Looks like you found some power armor. I've heard uh, of a chemical process that could use to harden the surface of the armor. However, I'm missing some. Uh, I'm missing some information which could give me the last few clues to the formula and in, in regiment. Uh, necessary. I've heard the librarian in the hub, Miss Stapleton, has some journals and books that might be able to be of some use. You could get these from. From there, I could uh, probably test the process on your armor. Sounds good. I'll go talk to Miss Mrs. Stapleton. This way. Uh, to the hub. Oops. Ooh, an encounter. Go for raiders. That's no problem, really. In your torso. Evaporated. Oops. Dead. Ten millimeters, that's it. And Man, man, man. <laughs> Unfortunate. Now, where was I? Um, downtown? Yeah, downtown. 
Librarian. Uh, do you have a, a set of chemistry journals? Miles and Adentium said you might. Uh, yes, I heard it from Miles, and I've heard uh, the ones he's looking for. They will cost you 750 caps. Sounds good. Here's the money. Here you are. Wait, what? What's what happening? What? So confused. Hey, what? Uh, thank you, stranger. I don't know how many weeks, perhaps months, those thugs have kept me in here. Uh, I'm very grateful for your help, and I'm sure the Brotherhood of Steel is, is also. Um, well, I'm glad that I could help. Thanks again. If you stop by the Brotherhood, I'd appreciate if you could tell Talus uh, now that I'm okay. Uh, I'm sure he's worried. Bye and take care. All right. Downtown? No, it's a dentium. I don't think I'm pronouncing that wrong. Uh, Alright. Chemist. Had a chance to get to the hub and visit the Mrs. Stapleton, right? Yes, I hear the books. Miles takes the books from you and starts flipping through the. Hmm, yes, hmm. He mumbles to himself for a few more minutes. Well, I think I can figure it out. Um, but it will take a full day for the uh, bonding to occur. Is that acceptable? Not a problem. Miles takes your armor from you. Miles hands your armor back to you, and it seems to glint a little more than it did before. Well, I think it worked. Hope it helps you out. Nice. Very nice. Save. Play Boneyard. Be the place. Hello, lad. What can, what might you be looking for today? Uh, who are you? Well, I'm at McRae, and I help the, help the blades against some death claws in the regular bunch. Teach them a bit about protecting themselves against those nasties. Uh, what kind of stuff do you teach them? Well, I'm specialty in fighting with the fist and talking a bunch or two than the guy thrown at me. Uh, can I ask you something else? I, what will you be looking to know? Uh, who are you? Yes, yeah, exactly. Um, have you seen the death class? Seen him? I have friend like him. I did. If you're looking for him, you'll find him over there. Please. Thanks for the info. All right, killed them. Me. So um. Oh, there's so much Nuka Cola. That. Cola everywhere. Okay, yeah, so the Blades, they're basically a gang or a group that, um, they're kind of evil, and they want to take over the south part of town, but I'm not going to let that happen. I wish I could interfere or actually stop them, but I don't know how. I don't think you can. Uh, yeah, they want to, they want to, they want to raid this settlement, and I don't know why.
Hey, this is like a, just a just trying to live. Hi, are you new here? Um, yes, I'm called Melon. I'm Lorraine. Can I ask you a few questions? I suppose. What do you want to know about? Can you give me some information about the LA Boneyard? This used to be a big city called Los Angeles, but the bombs hit really hard. Now there's just a, the Angels Boneyard. We adonters are just trying to survive in the wreckage. Can you tell me more about Los Angeles? Lots of people lived here, from what I hear. Survivors hid in a big place called a vault. It came out years later. Some of them started the regu regulators and then founded Adentium. While the, while the others formed the blades. The gun runners aren't from here originally. Where is this vault? Well, supposedly it was so, so, uh, somewhere south of here, but I don't, really, don't know really. I think everyone left because it was broken. Uh, tell me more about the other residents of Adentium. Uh, what do you want to know about? Okay, uh, John Zimmerman. Zimmerman watches over our town. He makes sure that everyone gets fed and that everyone has a job to do. Caleb? Caleb is the leader of the regulators and it's his job to protect Adentium. He seems to enjoy it a little more than we, he should. Miles. Uh, our resident chemist. Miles makes bullets and he also built the water distiller that makes sure that we get clean water from the well. He, he's working on the, on the underground farm right now, but he's missing some parts. Uh, Tyne. Tyne runs the shop. It's a bunker near the gate. He trades with the hub merchants for us. Smitty? Oh, uh -huh. uh, Smitty is a tinker of sorts. He's good at repair work. He casts bullets and fixes broken stuff around town. Okay. Alright. Um, where else can I go here? Um, save right here, actually. Yeah, I'm not going to help the blades take over this area. That's, that's, that's not who I am. First floor. Okay. There's Talus. Brother Mill and I've received word from Brother Jonathan. Thank you for rescuing him. You're welcome. As for your reward, I will give you a ch choice of one of the following. Um. Rocket launcher. Your authorization right now. Go pick it up from Mike from Michael. Hello oh, again. How are you doing today? Um, I just want to pick up. Let's see here. Uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, rocket launcher. Uh, no, that's it. Thanks. Over encumbered. Now it's time to go to Shady Sands, and we're gonna we're gonna let dog meat stay there. All right, the uh, dog meat can stay here forever. This is where he where he'll live for the remaining of his days, away from danger. We lost our two companions in the bat in the heat of battle, but. Was at a cost. <clears throat> Stay here and wait, okay? Because he will die in the future if he comes with me. Right, this will conclude this episode of Fallout 1 in 2023. This episode we actually covered the Boneyard, the LA Boneyard, or the wreckage from uh, the ruins of Los Angeles, California. In the next one, we're going to go with the Brotherhood of Steel, and we're going to initiate the ending, the last chapter of the game, where we uh, really change the end, and get the good ending, so, yeah. 
We'll see you on the next one.